I'm Maxine Mune. I'm an art student, and I'm not from here. I'm one of near 9 million visitors to this beautiful state each year. Studying in Hawaii is an amazing opportunity, especially as an artist. The environment I'm in plays a huge role in my paintings. I take tons of inspiration from my travels. But traveling has a big impact on the planet. If you're between 18 and 34, then you're definitely aware of and probably worried about climate change. We all know to turn off lights, open the blinds, ditch disposable plastic, and recycle. But tourism is responsible for one-tenth of carbon emissions, and more and more people are traveling each year. There are so many ways to travel today, and they all use energy. But as a student and a traveler, I can make choices that help, and so can you. Travel by plane and by train are unsurprisingly the worst but they're not a whole lot worse than going solo in a car with poor mileage. Driving services like Uber and Lyft work okay if you're carpooling, but you can save energy and money by taking the bus, which most students get a discount at and saves about 15% more energy than driving solo. You can also walk, which is free and better for your health anyway. Something I do to save energy is walking to the store and then taking an Uber back when it gets dark or if I have a load of groceries. But if I planned my trips better, I could bus back. When traveling a long distance, there are also some things to watch for. Some airlines are working at becoming more efficient, like Ryanair, EasyJet, and Continental, which lower prices to fill their planes and manage fuel better. American and Delta have newer, more efficient planes, and United launched EcoSkies to find alternate fuels. If a cruise is more your speed, the good news is that cruise companies seem to be very aware of how much fuel and energy they use. Top of the list were Carnival, Costa, Crystal, and Disney, who all strive for 100% recycling of waste, as well as training crew members to be good stewards of the planet and hiring environmental officers. While traveling to a new place, it also helps to eat as locally as possible. It helps reduce energy from shipping and food at the same time it boosts local agriculture. Wherever you are and wherever you're going, you can always learn to save energy in a healthy environment. Try to leave as little impact as possible. You can remember the place, but the place doesn't need to remember you. Keep exploring and stay curious.